Hello everyone, in this video tutorial, I will show you how we can generate the aspect, slope and curvature maps to generate within the ArcGIS Pro. We will go to the Analysis tab, Geo Processing Tools and within the, uh, the Spatial Analysis Tools, go to the Surface. Within the Surface, we have Aspect, Contours, we have already cover the contours curvature cut fill and all the other tools are available here so i will select the for example first of all let me calculate the slope for this digital elevation model select the digital elevation model if you need the output measurement in degrees you can select the degrees or percent rise and you can also click the met method planar geodesic i will select the planar for now and target device for analysis i will select only gpu and C the cpu oh they, they all i will retain all these by default the z factor as well okay now click run all right uh, the slope have been calculated for for area of interest now let me change the symbology and I will change it to the to this color. If all of the color uh, schemes aren't available, are not showing here, so you can click on the show all, and all of the scheme will be available, and will you will you can then select from here. Okay. Here you can see the slope like this. So what actually these values value means this color uh, the bill the green dark green color means that the uh, slope of this area is very low okay and it's less than 1.72 degrees the slope for this area is very low so actually this area is uh, very uh, planar okay here you can see the for this area the elevation is less than or equal to 90 and if you see this color for example the orangish color for this it's actually the greater uh, less than or equal to 45 degrees it means for this color this one let me change it to the blue color so let, the, i can see it now this means that the degree the uh, the slope for this area is between 90 and 45 degrees okay so this is very a uh, very high slope you can see it here so these are the slope in uh, the values are in slope and degrees okay you can also change it like to if I don't need, for example, uh, in the classified, you can change it to the stretch as well from here like this and change the color. Okay, so you can also do it like this. So it varies from 0 degrees to 73 degrees. The slope varies from 0 to 73 degrees. Okay, right now. I will uncheck it. Now let me generate the aspect for uh, this digital elevation model. I will select the extracted DEM aspect planar. Okay, leave it as by default. Now click run. Actually, what does actually the slope, uh, the aspect means? The aspect means that what is the direction of the slope of the mountain? The direction, the slope of the direction of the mountain, for example. You can see here this red color, this red color. We have two red colors, okay? From zero to, to uh, okay, first of all, I will talk about the flat minus one degree 
flat actually this is uh, from minus 1 to uh, 0 degree or you can say uh, this uh, this area is flat now from 0 to 22.5 degrees and 30 337.5 to 360 degrees means from 337.5 degrees to 22.5 degrees actually it shows it has uh, been uh, colored so let me change the color for this like uh, i will select this color for example so here the red color actually what the red color actually means this red color this red color means from the north 0 degree to the 22.5 degrees the direction of these slope are in the 0 to 22.5 degree direction okay and the northeast 22.5 to 67.5 degrees so this color actually represent uh, let me change the red color to this white color and now let me make it red so that I can differentiate so this red color what actually the red color means the direction of the slope of these mountains are in the 22.5 to 67.5 dire uh, degree direction okay actually this is the north this is the east south and west so this is the 22 to 67.5 Five, five direction so actually it's actually shows the direction of the slope of the mountains nothing else okay now uh, we will create curvature here you can see the curvature okay uh, extracted DEM curvature okay now output profile curve also you can say generate output profile curve for, for now I will run it so here you can see the the curve or the this is actually also in the uh, degrees so let me change the color So this area is very flat and the red color area is curved okay the red or the orange -ish, like this you can see it from here like this here we don't have any curve so this is why this area is being colored like zero degrees it's been marked zero this area like this this area somehow okay now we we will generate the hill shade go to the geoprocessing tools hill shade within the hill shade you can select the digital elevation model uh, and extract like the extracted DM okay what actually this azimuth means this azimuth means the direction of the light the sun from from what direction we have the sun or the light source and this is the elevation from the surface okay if i i will leave it uh, these by default and now click run So here you can see you have selected the 315 degrees uh, direction of for the sun. So it means that this is, the sun is from this direction, from this direction. So here you can see the the shadow is the shadow has been formed on this direction, on this side of the mountain. You can see. I will change the uh, direction of the sun to, for example, now to. Uh, 120 for example let me change it and i will leave the altitude 45 and now we will see that the direction of the shades will be on this side of the mountain now click run it it will be modified this one will be modified
now here you can see the direction of the, this is the white or the light source from where the source uh, pointed or directed and this is the opposite side of the mountain so here you can see on the western side are uh, now we will change the other uh, parameters like uh, I will once again select this uh, extracted DM kill shade and now 315 I will leave it that one and now let me select the 90 degrees so the 90 uh, degree altitude means that the light source will be directly perpendicular on this area so we will have no hill shade or shade of these mountains so how will uh, the, this will look like so let me run it now you can see that we don't have that uh, shades like uh, appearance within the digital elevation model like this because the light direction is directly perpendicular on the uh, on this surface now let me make it zero so zero mean the uh, altitude of the light is just only on the surface in the direction of zero degree altitude of zero degree so i will click run and you will see a lot of shades and almost black color of the hill shade. Here you can see the, all of all the extracted DM have been converted into shades. That's why. So you can play around with these options and you can explore it furthermore as well.